Good morning, world. I am Judy, your web-based therapist, making therapy accessible and convenient for our clients in Florida and New York, and of course, sharing information worldwide. Today, I wanted to, I guess we could say, do a little pep talk for our people with ADHD, because over the last few weeks with, during this pandemic, I've heard a lot of, the pandemic has brought out some insecurities, some made people start thinking some thoughts that I would like to take some time to address because it's the pandemic is bringing out some negative views or negative thoughts that I think we should talk about. One thing I've heard a lot of people say is that feeling of feeling like they're not smart, feeling like they're less than, feeling like people, some people have mentioned that they feel stupid, that they feel dumb because they are in this position of having to do all this home-based learning, all this home-based working and be being thrown into situations that have made them feel less than competent. And I want to say that is not true. You are smart. Don't let anyone tell you any different. You are brilliant. You have talent. You have skills. You've managed to live and thrive in a world that is not built to support you in a world that is not, um, that is not even trying to accommodate your needs. So you are smart. You have managed. You have um, created systems, resources, and you've found tools to help you work, to help you thrive, to help you grow and develop in this world that has not even been trying to help you. So don't let either this situation or anyone else tell you anything other than, yes, you are actually pretty smart because you figured out a whole bunch of stuff. Two, yes, you can do it. Whatever it is, yes, you can do it because you've been doing it. All these years you've been thriving, all these years you've been making things happen, you've been finding ways, you've been finding ways to compensate, you've been finding ways to overcompensate, you've been finding ways to do things to make stuff happen. So this is no different. Just as you have adjusted in the past, you can and will adjust through this. And when we come out of this, you will be even better because you've hey, this is one more thing that you have learned. This is one more thing that you've developed. You can do it. You can't, you've done it before. Maybe not exactly this, but you've done more difficult stuff. You've done very difficult things before. And just because, and because you've had the experience of doing all these other very difficult things with very little help a lot of time, because of all those skills you've developed over the years, you're good. You're going to make it through this too. Two, actually three. You're different and it's okay. We're all different. Everyone, whether or not you have ADHD, whether or not you have anything else that happens to be, that's there to be had in the world, we are all different. We're all weird in our own little ways. And you know what? That's okay. That's what makes the world what it is. That's what makes the world as interesting as it is. There's absolutely nothing wrong with being different. Don't let anyone make you feel that being different is weird or actually we are weird because we're all humans and as humans we are all weird and that's okay. Don't let anyone make you feel less than because you have or you learn or you operate differently than they do. Maybe something is wrong with them. How about that? If someone is trying to tell you that, hey, something is wrong with you, maybe you could, you should have them consider what is wrong with you that you feel the need to try to bring me down in order for you to feel better. So it's okay to be different. We're all different. And that's what makes the world great. Four, there are resources available, so it's okay to use them. I've heard a lot of people talk about how they feel like they are imposing, that they feel like they shouldn't be asking or they're asking for too much. That's why resources are there. Whether it is resources at school, resources at work, whatever it is, if the resources are there, they are there to be used. So take the time, reach out to whomever you need to reach out and use the resources that are there to help you, to help support you, to help you thrive, to help you get through this. Right now, everyone, not just people with ADHD, is in need of, is in need of support, is in need of um, resources. So you're not imposing resources are there because people need them and you are actually you know what you're helping whoever's putting the resources out you're helping that person by utilizing whatever resources that they're making available so take the time if to find out what resources are available to you and utilize them as much as you can because that's what they're there for finally 
ADHD comes with benefits or ADD, ADHD, whichever one you have, they have benefits. People with ADHD have so many different talents, so many different skills, so much stuff that you've had to develop in order to thrive and succeed in this world. Take the time to figure out what your talents are. Take the time to figure out what your special skills are and nurture them and use them to give you that um, self-esteem boost. Because especially right now, when so many things are there chipping at your self-esteem, making you think or feel that maybe you are not, you know, that great or maybe you are not whatever use those talents, focus on your talents, focus on your skills, focus on what's great about you, focus on the things that make you awesome. ADHD has great benefits. People with ADHD have are some of the most successful, some of the most talented, some of the, uh, the most creative people I know have ADHD. So just figure out what it is, what your skills and talents are, and utilize and nurture them. Quick recap. One, you are brilliant, you are smart, um, and don't let anyone tell you any different because, hey, that's just who you are. Two, you can do it, whatever it is, you can do it because you've done so many other different things and this is no different. You, actually, this is different, but you will do it just like you have done everything else that you've managed to do. Um, three, you're different and it's okay. We're all different. Every person, whether or not you have whatever it is you may have or may not have, we're all different. And there is absolutely nothing wrong with being different. Difference is what makes the world as colorful, as bright, as awesome as it is. Four, take time to use resources that are available to you. There are resources all over the place. You're not imposing. You are not asking for too much. We're all using resources. That's what resources are there for. And finally, ADHD and ADD come with so many different uh, benefits. So figure out what your what your positives that you're getting that your ADHD is giving you. Figure out what your skills, your talents, your special whatever it is that comes from your ADHD. Figure out what those are. Nurture them. Take time to utilize them. Use them to help you give that to help give you that extra self esteem boost, that extra little confidence that other things in life may be taking away from you. As always, if you or someone else happens to be going through something that's more than you can handle, please remember there's a lot of help out there right now, even when many things are closed. There are professionals like myself who are offering remote services who are able, available, and willing to help. So please find out who those people are in your community so that you can reach out and get the help you need. And that is all we have for today. Good morning, world. Have an awesome day.